in terms of software, this is where I had a challenge before as well. You know, we were implementing OKRs. The team were very, they had a really good mechanism of communicating in their weekly meetings. They used yeah. Google slide shares. It was very collaborative. They had Google slides. People would jump in and all fill in the slide beforehand and they'd yeah. run their meeting. And then we introduced as part of the OKR, an OKR tool. Now there's loads of tools out there. There's Ally. I think that was bought by Microsoft. There's Lattice. There's others out there. But um, the introduction of the tool actually caused challenges because everybody had to sort of try and switch things out or try and run APIs into that tool. And they ended up sort of fussing yeah. around getting the tool right. And I ended up focusing on the tool too much that um, yeah. you kind of missed the point. What are your thoughts around software and, and the role software plays? Yeah, so, so I mean, my take on this is that software can be, in, in, the, in the OKR space, can be really useful. It can actually solve problems. But here's the thing. We want to start, the OKRs is primarily about communication. It's primarily about people and human interactions. And so you want to start with that. And that's why I start with a small scope of like just the executive team, just company-wide. Let's communicate that. And then doing this, if you're communicating on that level of like, here's our company objectives for the whole organization. Let's communicate about them. Let's have check-ins with our the next layer down or the, the 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 project leaders or the product leaders or the functional leaders on what we're doing here and all that sort of stuff you can do this with all of the existing tools you can do it with with a combination of email zoom meetings where you present things a presentation a poster you know and all that sort of stuff P putting the accounts into the um uh, into the uh the regular metrics reviews putting them into the, the news email newsletter whenever you celebrate something refer to the executive or the key result that you're trying to get to so these things you don't need software for. What, when you need software is when you have a larger set of OKRs that you need to coordinate and track and sort of be be um, be tracking across the board. Now that only happens when you really when you have a very a relatively large organization. You can get by with this with, a, with quite a large organization like 50, 200 people, three hundred people, mm -hmm. without using any software. Just just mm -hmm. talking about things. And part of the reason for that is actually that if you're using OKRs, you don't have to have one OKR per one set of objectives and key results per person or per team or per manager, you just need them where you need them. So you might just have company OKRs, a product OKR, and some some for particular teams that need to make major changes, like marketing mm -hmm. or um, a, an operations team that needs to needs to sort of have a transform some sort of transformation, some sort of change about how they're doing things. But you don't need it for every single manager. That just creates yeah. confusion, and that means that if you look at it from each person's perspective, the individual contributor, they then look up and see like, well, I'm kind of working on that project, that product. So I've got an OK house set there, but then there's a manager there as well. So they've got an OK house set there and I've got my manager and then his manager or her manager. Mm. And so on. And I've got all these OK house and it's confusing. And that's a problem. Mm. And that's a problem that if you, if you go down the software path, it tends to generate that problem because software is usually set up to drive engagement and then they want to have more accounts. So you're sort of incentivized to do this. So I recommend just holding back from the software until you have a specific problem you want to solve where software can solve that problem.